Hey guys, thank you so much for joining me today and welcome to my channel. Today I am going to be propagating my prayer plant, which terrifies me, but needs to be done. This thing is exploding with growth and I want to give it a little bit more room in the pot. And I also think it would be nice to have some extra prayer plants. So I'm going to try propagating this in water and in soil actually because I think both of these work from what I've seen but I don't know which one of them works faster or better to kind of get a healthier plant quicker. So I want to try both ways to see if one of them works. Hopefully both of them work and we don't have none of them work. <laughs> I have a pair of scissors um, that I cleaned off very well with rubbing alcohol because again I'm very scared to do this. I love this plant so much. I don't want to stunt the growth. So I'm worried about sending this plant into shock, but we're just gonna do it. So let me go get my prayer plant. This is my pride and joy, guys. It's so pretty. This, I'm not trying to just say anything, but like this is a very nice looking prayer plant. That's all I'm gonna say. Very happy where it is, I think. It's so full and beautiful. And it just, do you see all of the new growth? Like all of these little twirlies are new leaves and it's going crazy and inside the pot just going crazy i really kind of don't want to do this <laughs> this kind of breaks my heart there's a section back here specifically because i have this on a shelf um against my wall and this stuff back here is just kind of smashed up against the wall it's not getting a ton of light and it looks like there are some places where I can easily cut where I probably am not even going to notice, so it won't break my heart. So, <laughs> from what I've seen, you want to cut um, your piece for propagation off of a prayer plant or a Maranta plant right below the node because this is actually where the new roots are going to start growing. And if I look at like some of my bigger, ooh, more established branches, I can see where roots are kind of already, I mean, they'd pop out pretty quick if I put that in soil. But that's not where I'm going to cut today. So I think I'm going to take this cutting, or this right here, and I think I'm gonna take this here, actually. I think I'm gonna take this whole piece because then I can have three plants out of this. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Okay, so here we go. Let's just cut. And I don't think it matters too much how far down you cut. But I'm so sorry. I really don't. <laughs> mm. Do I want to do this? Oh, this makes me sad. Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, this is killing me. Okay, <laughs> how different does it look? So, oh jeez, okay. Now, this one I can show you. Oh, I apologize for my dirty nails because obviously I've been playing with my plants all day. But I believe this right here, these little dots, can you see? Can you see? Can you see that? But those little dots are going to be roots. So this should root. And this should root, so I'm gonna cut this and I'm gonna cry if it doesn't work. How different does she look? Are you okay? Did you survive? I think it was attempting to flower here and maybe here. I don't think the flowers made it very far. I don't really understand that. Okay, we're done with you. You can just go back to hanging out and being amazing. And then I'm going to I'm gonna cut this right at that node. So right in between these two, because hopefully that's the right thing to do. And again, I'm gonna be very upset if that's incorrect. Did I just mess this up? I hope I didn't just mess this up. Hopefully not. So I'm going to just put this little guy down there in the dirt. And you guys, feel free to let me know if I did this all wrong. Cause I probably, oh, cause I probably did. So I'm sticking these pretty far down there to make sure that the nodes are 
pretty well covered. So, and then hopefully that turns into plants in a month or so. And then this I am going to, I think you're supposed to take these leaves off. Okay, maybe that makes sense because it looks like right there are some more of those little dots where we want to grow roots. So that is going to go into some water and there we go. So I will update you guys, whoever cares, on the progress of this um, as soon as I have an update or when I notice something in particular. But um, yeah. If you guys have any comments or feedback, feel free to leave it in the comments below. Thank you guys for watching today. Please like this video if you liked it so that I know. And subscribe if you want to be notified. Subscribe so that you can get notifications whenever I upload new videos so that you know that I have posted a new video. And you can find me on social media at Simple Care Steph on Instagram or on my blog, uh, simplecareproducts.com. I almost forgot. And that's it. Yes, I'm gonna go cry now and dust off my plant because they're really dusty also, but I'll see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching my weird videos. Oh, bye.